a prophet will not be killed outside Jerusalem. And then the Muslim says, well, Jesus was killed on Calvary. I'm not sure about the geographical area about where no, Jesus No, I've already was. answered this thoroughly. <clears throat> Go to Luke 13. I know what he's referring to. Luke 13, right? He's mentioning Luke. So let me get you the article now. I wrote an article on this. Guys, uh, repeat the objection. I won't cut you off. Just repeat the objection, but let me go get the article because I wrote one on it. So there's a verse in the Bible in Luke chapter 13, 33, and Jesus says that, you know, a prophet won't be killed outside of Jerusalem. Mm -hmm. But Jesus, I'm not sure the 100% yeah, like he, he was he was he was crucified outside the city wall on a, okay. on a mount. So, so Jesus yeah. was crucified outside the city wall. And Muslims like to say that because Jesus wasn't crucified in Jerusalem, either he wasn't a prophet or he wasn't crucified. Yeah. Here's the article on this, guys. Here's the article. Uh, see, glory to Jesus Christ, because I've heard all these arguments. We've written articles on it. Here's the article. Lord, will I put in the description box, the comment section. I'm going to give you I'm going to give you the link. OK, so you guys heard the objection. Read Luke 13, 33 for us, sister. Could you ask him the article because it's i'm not on the youtube i just gave it to you no, no i gave it to you okay so just read the, uh, the verse if you can yes. in any case i must press on today and tomorrow and the next day for surely no prophet can die outside jerusalem okay so see jesus died outside jerusalem he was beaten in the city taken out of the city con contradiction ha 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 ha, ha. He, he, he. right mm -hmm. okay now how do we respond to this you guys ready for the response <clears throat> yes Okay, now, go to Luke 13, same chapter. Now, I want you to start reading from 31 to 35. Guys, pay attention. Luke 13, 31 to 35. Pay attention now, because we're now going to show the Muslims they're desperate, more desperate than Muhammad when he's looking for a woman to molest. Okay? Luke 13, 31 to 35. Let's read it. Okay. Jesus' sorrow for Jerusalem. At that time, some Pharisees came to Jesus and said to him, Leave this place and go somewhere else. Herod wants to kill you. He replied, Go tell that fox, I will keep on driving out demons and healing people today and tomorrow, and on the third day, I will reach my goal. In any case, I must press on, and today and tomorrow and the next day, for surely no prophet slowly, can die slowly. outside Jerusalem. Yeah, just read it slowly so you understand what you're reading. Not too fast. Okay. Because in the debate, okay. you got to be fast, but slow enough, they get the point. Okay, so now keep reading to 35. Jerusalem, Jerusalem, you who kill the prophets and stone those sent to you. Mm -hmm. How often I have longed to gather your children together as a hen gathers her chicks under her wings, and you were not willing. Look, your house is left to you desolate. I tell you, you will not see me again until you say, blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Now, let me ask you a question. <clears throat> when he says, Jerusalem, Jerusalem, you who have killed the prophets. Who's he referring to? Who killed the prophets? The city, the dirt that they walked on, or the people? The, the people. They killed the, okay. the former prophets before Christ. So when he says Jerusalem, Jerusalem, is he referring to an inanimate city, or is he using Jerusalem to refer to the leaders of Jerusalem? Uh, the leaders, the leaders. So the meaning of the context is no prophet can be killed outside of Jerusalem, meaning that he has to go to the Jewish re leaders and be condemned by them. That's what Jerusalem means in the context. Wow, okay, that you makes that? so much sense. Okay, so so what's Jerusalem in the context? It's the, the leaders of the, the, the temple or the Pharisees. Of the city. The Jewish people. The leaders of the city. So when he says no prophet can be killed outside of Jerusalem, means no prophet can be condemned apart from the Jewish religious <clears throat> leaders establishment. And Are you Jesus seeing that? Because again, that's not my Jesus interpretation. Yeah. It's not my interpretation. How did you find Jerusalem? Right in the verses after 33. Now read 33, 35 so it can sink in. Okay. In any case, I must press on today and tomorrow and the next day, for surely no prophet can die outside Jerusalem. Then he calls out Jerusalem. Jerusalem, Jerusalem, you who kill the prophets and stone those Now you make the connection. No prophet yeah. can be killed outside of Jerusalem. Oh, Jerusalem, you who kill the prophets. Mm -hmm. I see that. I see it very clearly. So who who is Jerusalem that's going to kill Jesus like he, she, it killed the prophets? The people, the, city, the leaders of the city. The so it's not talking Jerusalem. about I have to be killed in the city. I have to be killed by the religious establishment in Jerusalem, which is exactly what happened, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, now, let me give you further proof that Jesus is not saying they won't kill me outside the city. 
He's saying Jerusalem as the religious establishment, the leaders, <clears throat> the religious authorities that govern Jerusalem, they will condemn me to, to death. They will kill me. It has nothing to do with me not dying outside the city. The same Jesus goes on to give the parable of the tenants, right? Mm -hmm. Go to Luke 20, verses 13 and 15. Then the owner of the vineyard said, What shall I do? I will send my son whom I love. Perhaps they will respect him. But when the tenants saw him, they talked the matter over. This is their heir, they said. Let's kill him and the inheritance will be ours. So they, they, they threw him out the vineyard. Wait, the vineyard him. is Jerusalem. Yeah. So when did they kill him? When they threw him out of the vineyard, vineyard. Yeah. And killed him. They threw okay. So where was Jesus killed? Outside of the outside of Jerusalem. So where's the contradiction? There is not. Just there a misunderstand. Well, not misunderstanding, just blatant. Yeah, it's all in my article, by the way. It's all there.